Hi guys, um, we went to Aldi. <laughs> Got more than I thought I was gonna. I was about, oh, five days overdue from when I thought I should go because people have been sick and I was sick and I slept for like a whole day and all night and I had my granddaughter because her mama, who is very pregnant, was sick. So I had her overnight, but then, oh man. Anyways, we were all feeling good. So we went shopping. First of all, I went to Sprouts because I had to exchange a pineapple. I got a pineapple last week and it was like, for real, fermented. <laughs> it was like effervescent, it was leaking out the bottom. But they traded, so that was awesome. And then I just got an extra firm tofu, which we've been making Reuben sandwiches out of lately, and so yummy. And then all the, I kind of started stocking up for when more people are coming over Christmas time, but I saved, saved some things for next week. I didn't want to go crazy, but I got way more. Like I said, I was, late in going. So anyways, here we go. Two tortillas. Uh, corn chips, probably for putting on top of chili. I think I'm going to make a huge pot of chili at our family Christmas and put that in a crock pot for just one thing. I'm just going to kind of have all kinds of different things. So maybe everyone can find something they like. Um, two bags of our black sesame gluten-free crackers. This is probably gonna go with a big batch of chickpea dip, which I have on a different video. Um, Kleenexes, we've gone through tons of those. I had to grab another box. Those are really nice, the store brand. Two ketchups, we were like all out of ketchup, just about. I need more regular dish soap. I like to put this in a little squirty pump by the kitchen sink so that when people are just washing like one pan or something, they can just use a little pump. And then we also have that sitting there for the whole sink full of dishes. I got two jars of jalapenos because we keep running out lately. I use a good amount in the chickpea dip. So I got two to try to catch up with that. Um, this is kind of a stocking up for Christmas time, a medium and a mild salsa. Just something to munch on. Pumpkin, I make our gluten-free roll-out cookies with um, pumpkin, so I wanted to make sure I had some. Some regular diced tomatoes for chili and whatever. I got a big, what is this, 10 pounds? 10 pounds of russet potatoes. I think another thing at Christmas time I'm gonna do is a bunch of Hasselback potatoes and then have different toppings for people to put on. Just that, that would be yummy. Got some pink lady apples. We're all out. Two chocolates, I got dark mint and a dark sea salt. These are accidentally vegan from Aldi, I love it. Very cool, reasonable price. Frozen spinach, I'm planning on making some spinach dip for our Christmas time and we thought we'd try their veggie burgers. I've tried their veggie burgers before but hopefully they've changed them up a little bit. The package looks a little different because the first round <clears throat> I wasn't thrilled with. I'm going to throw these in the freezer. And two vanilla almond milk. and. I got a ton of cereal in preparation, <laughs> partly for Christmas stuff, like I'll show you. I was thinking of making some peanut butter bars, the crispy bars, you know, and then one of my daughters and my daughter-in-law said they're going to make more Muddy Buddies, so I got these. I don't get the wheat ones because... Half of us are gluten free, so I just get the corn and rice, and that will work for the Muddy Buddies. And then I got these and these because my husband's coming and <laughs> because Renee loves cereal. But my husband really loves cereal for snacking. So 
so I just kind of stocked up on that. Um, peach tea, they had no lemonade mix. Oh my word. They had three, three boxes of these drink mixes. There was hardly any peach. It was like all grape drink mix, which I've never even tried. Maybe I should try it because like there's always tons of grape, but maybe it's no good. That's why. Anyway, stevia for my coffee. And then one, two, I might as well put them up here, right? <laughs> All their bananas were like pretty ripe this time. Sometimes they're super green. Three, four, bunches of bananas. Most of those will go into smoothies. Uh, apple juice for smoothies mostly. Another bag of Halo mandarins. We've been loving these. My granddaughter chows on them. She loves them too. And I found the coconut spread that I was trying to find last time. Or that a different Aldi this time. And this was the last one. So that's really nice. It'll be good for um, Christmas baking. Celery, broccoli. Are you going? Carrots. I was just really hungry for carrots. Uh, cucumber. Lettuce. Big bomber cauliflower. I found a really nice big one. It's as big as my head. <laughs> uh, Renee wanted some more crackers, buttery rounds. And I was running out of diapers <laughs> for Ryland, my granddaughter. I just like to use them when she's here to help out in a little way. Big pack of toilet paper. I stopped at Aldi last week really quick, like on the way back from taking my daughter to work. And they just had the four packs, so I got two of them. But this was a different Aldi. They had this huge one. I just didn't want to think about it over Christmas time, so got that. I just, I don't like running out of essentials of stuff like that. Toilet paper, shampoo, um, dish soap. I don't really like running out of essentials. I've been married for over 30 years and we've never run out. Um, I can't think of anything worse than sitting on the toilet and not having any toilet paper. That's ridiculous. Um, so whatever. I just, I hope you're having a good uh, week in preparation for Christmas. Um, like I said, some of this stuff is for Christmas time. Others is just, we need to eat, right? Um, and in the midst of all the craziness and busyness, remember to have fun. Merry Christmas. I don't know how this is going to work, but I just really want to wash all these shopping bags. They're getting kind of dirty, grody, I don't know what. I'll see how that turns out. Okie dokie. Here's the tofu Reuben that I was talking about. Um, there's the tofu marinated tofu in there and then sauerkraut and mayo and brown mustard grill them up on some pumpernickel rye really yummy